but we do have relief on the way coming okay. soon. See Stacy at uh, tomorrow. Another hot one though. We've got temperatures today already at 100. Yesterday we hit the mid to upper 90s across the state. Today officially at 100 degrees. Tomorrow we're forecasting 100 as well. So we'll be pretty close to that triple digit mark here uh, for the day on Thursday. Temperatures right now still hanging out right at 100 for Runnels. We're in the upper 90s for Des Moines, West Des Moines, Johnston 100 as well up in Ankeny at the 5 o'clock hour. Dew points again. This is a measure of how much moisture in the air. It gives us an idea of how it feels outside and when you get dew points this high, sitting in the upper 70s to low 80s. That's like South Florida kind of weather, what it feels like outside. Tropical air mass, feel the moisture in the air, and it's just miserable to be outside. Those dew points stay high for another day as well before I think we see a little bit of relief heading into the weekend. Heat indices, what it feels like, uh, actual feels like temperature outside, 115 to 120. So pretty miserable uh, for our Wednesday night. Unfortunately, we've got that going for one more day on Thursday. Temperatures tomorrow forecasting right around 100. The record high for Des Moines is 104 for tomorrow's date. That sets back or is, was set back in 1936. So I think we'll be close to hitting that. I think we'll be a little bit off from that record tomorrow. Nonetheless, it's still going to be extremely hot and miserable to be outside for another day in a row here. 12 hour forecast keeps us warm and muggy overnight tonight will fall only to right around 80 or so here in the city. Dew points stay high in that 70 degree plus category through about Friday and then they'll drop off as we head closer towards Saturday and Sunday. Still somewhat muggy, but definitely feeling a lot better than what it's felt like yesterday uh, and felt like today as well. Temperatures hanging out in the 90s at least for a couple more days before we get a little bit of relief back closer to normal by Saturday, Sunday and Monday where we drop back into the 80s. So that will feel a little bit better as we head into the weekend. Future cast looks like this. We are staying dry for the time being. We've got a cold front that comes through tomorrow. It's going to kind of sag into the state. I don't think it'll make a big impact for central and southern Iowa. It'll take a little bit longer to get into the southern portion of the state. I think if you're in northern Iowa, you might get a little bit of relief or notice a little relief tomorrow. Otherwise, by Thursday night, clouds roll in. There's a chance for a shower storm across northern Iowa, and that chance does exist through Friday morning. And then we've got another boundary down to our south that'll spark off a few more showers and storms. I think down into Missouri uh, by late Friday night into Saturday. Other than that, we're pretty quiet aside from the heat. Tomorrow's forecast looks like this. Temperatures here in the white. We climb up to near 100. Heat indices again, upwards of 105, 110, 115 for some places again tomorrow. And that excessive heat warning does go until tomorrow evening. Tonight, warm and muggy. I think we stay back into the upper 70s to low 80s for the metro area, unfortunately. And then tomorrow, back up into the upper 90s, if not triple digits, with a little bit of cloud cover at times. Tomorrow, another uh, weather aware day for the heat. Low 90s on Friday, we're talking upper 80s Saturday. We'll stay in the 80s as we head into Sunday and Monday. Still warm, but much better as we go into next week. Stacy.